Let's try that. I'm going to count from three to one and let's switch and let that stone express itself. Three, two, one, switch. Hello there. Um, hello. Hello. What would you like to tell us today? Why are you there in the heart of Valentina? I just feel comfortable there. Mm -hmm. mm. Tell me something about yourself. What is it that you do? I occupy space. Mm -hmm. That is comfortable. Mm -hmm. You're taking up space in her heart. Yes. Very good. And what is your purpose? I don't know. Each type of stone has certain qualities. What about you? What type of stone are you? How can Valentina make best use of you, of your qualities? I'm very solid. Mm -hmm. Very solid. And she she has this like um, light, airy quality, and she doesn't have stability. Mm -hmm. And so you are providing that solidness. Is that it? But it's in the wrong. It's it's uh, the solidness has to be. Is it no. not in the right amount? Not not in the right space. Not in that space. Very good. Very good. Thank you for communicating with us. I'm going to switch back to Valentina. One, two, three. Switch. Valentina, what do you think about this stone? What should happen? Do you want to take use of it? It's your stone. You can do with it whatever you want. Well, I, I don't want this in my chest. You don't it, want it, it in it, your it, chest. It, I feel it's like blocking me, blocking mm -hmm. my, my flow. Very good. So it's blocking the flow. So and actually, I feel like... Uh, I feel some movement. It's it's right here right now. Mm -hmm. Very good. Notice that. What is that moving movement? Where does it come from? It it moved from my chest to my stomach. Mm -hmm. Is it the stone that's moving, or is it something else? Well, that's what I felt the stone here, and mm -hmm. now I don't feel it here. So. Mm -hmm. um, it's not like really heavy in my stomach. Mm -hmm. it, it's just uh, I, I felt this movement and mm -hmm. to, just to feel my stomach right now, but it's not like extremely heavy, like just mm -hmm. um, might be just different sensation. Very good. Is the, the stomach where you would like to keep that stone or do you want something else to happen to it? No, I, I don't want this stone in my stomach. Very good. Well, if it's possible, I mean, I need this um, around me. Mm -hmm. Like, kind of like um, protection against uh, negativity. A shield. A shield, yes. Very good. Well, we can transform this stone into something else into a shield. Now imagine taking that stone out of your stomach. 
taking it into your hands. Very good. And with your beautiful hands, with your Reiki abilities, let energy flow towards that stone and transform it, manipulate it and shape it. And program it just like you would program a gem. Program it to protect you like a shield. And what is it that you would like to be protected against? Okay, negative influences. Negative influences. Describe those influences that are negative. Give me an example. Well, I feel them like, um, like wave, like, like mm -hmm. negative, um, like tar wave. Um, just has this like like tar um, yes uh, imagine that shield warding off those negative influences in the shape of tar what else would you like to be protected against That solid shield. How can it serve you better? Um, from maybe from negative people too. Mm -hmm. Negative and people, entities, uh, just mm -hmm. the ill vision people. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Very good, protecting you against negative people, negative influences, negative entities, and anyone that wishes ill upon you, that is just their desire. They can keep it to themselves, it does not affect you, because now you have this protective shield around you, not in your heart, but around your energetic field. Very good. What do you notice now about that shield? Are you pleased? Or is there anything you'd like to change? Well, how it holds this uh, space around me, like chamber mm -hmm. around me, and it, it's big. Mm -hmm. And this uh, stone, like the way I build it, kind of like spread it thin around, uh, around like, like the sphere around me. Mm -hmm. So for, so for some reason, it's still kind of transparent too. Mm -hmm. So it kind of like change its uh, quality. I mean, it's stone, but it um, doesn't look like stone anymore. It just has this like layer. Is it like a crystal? Mm, not sure. That, no, it doesn't feel like crystal. Maybe like more like gl glass or something mm -hmm. else. Very not glass. I, I, I don't, I'm not sure what it is. It, it just, um, I don't have name for this. It just feels like some layer of uh, like hard material around, but still transparent. Mm -hmm. um, and so it's able to ward off certain influences, but it also allows light inside. Allow it to well, allow I, light in and yes. out. 
yes, I want this. It's very important that you keep shining through that layer. Yeah, I imagine this um like from the like the light, like golden mm -hmm. the rays, um feeling this sphere. It was kind of dark before, but mm -hmm. um not dark but um no kind of like uh, dim. Right now it's like ray the golden rays, like threads of the golden threads. Wonderful. Like feeling this and feeling the space and like rays of uh, the slide goes through this protection too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I can feel it. Very good. And how are you feeling inside of this radiant sphere? Do you feel comfortable or does anything need to change? Let me feel it. I feel, I feel I need uh, more light and like stronger flow, like flow, mm -hmm. like cu current of light. Very good. Where does that light come from? What's the source of this light? Where shall we go to shop for more light? Uh, Supreme Creator. Supreme Creator. Wonderful. Very good. And tell me what happens as you look for more light to come into your sphere. I feel it inside. Very good. Allow that light to come in. Such abundance of light. You can take as much as you need because there's more than enough. Let all that beautiful light in. Very good. And light is something that can ward off negativity without blocking off anything beautiful. Okay, I feel like right here it's like s center. Mm -hmm. And it radiates, it, it's really powerful. It, mm -hmm. it radiates like far beyond this protection mm -hmm. like, that they build. It, it just, um, it, it's big, it, it's huge. Wonderful. And it, it kind of looks difficult to talk right now. It, it just... Just allow it, it, just feel it. Yeah, I want to feel it for a second. Yes, that's wonderful. And it radiates because it's transparent, like a candle inside of a glass bulb. Radiating way beyond. I feel like this light. Mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's really big. It's kind of, you know, like I, I, it's like all my perceptions, it's kind of like kinesthetic, physical and energetic. Mm -hmm. So I don't see, but um, I thought of this like surface of the earth and this like light is, uh, it's, it's really big, it covers like a lot, a lot of um, 
distance and mm -hmm. space around it kind of like wave just gives us like burst of um like the sort like i'm like the source of this um also like you know like burst of energy and it spreads mm -hmm. around me yes um like big, big distance um mm -hmm. but now it's not overpowering it's it's just um it's it's calm and it's powerful but it's not like too much to hold mm -hmm. It's not blinding. It's not blinding. It's not suffocating. It just um, kind of is. That's wonderful. So with this light now, perhaps you have some more clarity to see things about you, about your life that you are uncertain about. Take a look now with that light and tell me what you see. Do you need to be uncertain? Okay, I, I don't really like see anything what mm -hmm. comes to mind. It's just, um, you know, like air quality. It's it kind of like occupies space, like spreads everywhere. But it's 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 lack of focus. Mm -hmm. It's uh, it's it's just everywhere. Um, so I have this. Um, have this quality that, that that's my quality it's um tell it's, me something about that quality um it's it's lack of focus like a focus it, it's too many things happening at the same time and wanting different things happening and what does just, that cause for you it caused some like mental fog mm -hmm. um and what does this mental fog prevent you from doing To, um, to, see, to see the end like where I want to go the end kind of like goal picture in front of me mm -hmm. so I'm Um, I I can't like see far. What 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 is my? What really do I want? Mm -hmm. But a lot of a lot of different things happening. Um, in front of me and I, I do this and this and this uh it, it's kind of like simultaneous mm -hmm. but this is my nature too it's it's always been like this kind of like um it's, it's not like setting um like so far reaching stuff 
it's just kind of moving in um, like some directions that goes there and might be like seen more clearly when I get like closer but it, it's it's kind of like you're holding log, uh, light in um, fog mm -hmm. and you're trying to see like is it like is it this like really this what 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 do I need like searching searching um, I understand and is this is this the way it should be for you to take one step at a time holding that light just a little bit ahead of you or is it better for you to see the end picture in your mind what is best for you um I, i'm not sure it's like it's my nature and i i do complain about this i i don't like like my certain qualities mm -hmm. so it's um it's 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 hard for me to set a direction and just like follow it no matter what mm -hmm. because i have too many other things that interest me mm -hmm. but they it's like many parallel things that i don't want to just uh get rid of because they they interest me too but mm -hmm. because it's like too many directions i disperse my energy mm -hmm. and i don't move too far and too much or too fast maybe as as, as i want sometimes mm -hmm. because it's just like too many things um happening and sometimes okay. nothing happening because i pull in different directions um very good. Let's imagine that mental fog now. See it as a fog. Imagine that fog and we're going to clear some of that fog now. Imagine that fog clearing up little by little, starting to see the road ahead of you, gaining clarity more and more. Very good. And imagine all those things that interest you. Imagine putting all of them into one suitcase. Neat and tidy into one suitcase. Organized perfectly. And as you close the suitcase and pick it up, you notice that the suitcase is becoming lighter and lighter and you are becoming stronger and stronger as you start to move step by step towards the fog seeing just enough of the road just enough for you to see and each time you are approaching the fog, the fog just goes further back, further back, like a rainbow. You never ever reach the fog. You always see just enough of the road for you to be able to keep walking in the right direction, knowing that all your interests inside of your suitcase belong together none of it contradicts the other it all fits perfectly together like a puzzle pieces of you valentina you need all these interests they all complement each other the way you need all the parts of your body in order to function as a human being. Becoming stronger, gaining focus. And after a while, the fog seems to have disappeared completely the way it usually does as dawn sets in and the sun starts to shine 
and you can see clearly now because after every night comes a daytime time for action time for clarity and sometimes it needs to be nighttime in order for you to rest restore your energy just embrace that just allow that process to happen sometimes it's natural it's normal it's beneficial very good and how are you feeling it feels so good very it's, good thank you it actually this um you know this uh, exercise that you gave me like to put everything in my um suitcase and i kind of like blew on the fog and it, like went away Mm -hmm. I, I look like inside myself I feel so different I feel more like one mm -hmm. and it feels good and I feel like um, um, you know like <laughs> kind of like if you see rails mm -hmm. like ra railroad trails they yes. like sh sh Kind of like different. Uh, they're not like going like completely, yes. you know, astray. But like few in front of me, and mm -hmm. they like light with gold. And I, I feel, I feel more comfortable. Like more like put together. Very good. Uh, inside myself, like. Uh, yeah, like more like one piece. Very good. And it feels it feels very good. Wonderful. And you can do this exercise whenever you start feeling that you're going in different directions. Knowing that it's all part of you. Very good. You can also imagine all those strands coming together into one thread. Yeah, I feel like, you know, if you take, like many wires go into one cable. Yes, exactly. And it's um, like each little wire brings more and more power in this cable yes. become like, you know, full of electricity and power and it just like light exactly yes you need all of them very good embrace all your interests and all your qualities very good now you can open your eyes now and welcome back oh, thank you so much well, thank you <laughs> was it oh. oh it was it was good yeah i like these sessions the energetic <laughs> ones they're a bit challenging at first but then you kind of get into the flow it's, oh you you yeah. you're wonderful you just come up with this uh beautiful imagery <laughs> and uh like everything know. yeah everything you came from <laughs> I was like, oh, how do I come up with this stuff? <laughs> no, it was great. And everything, like every word you're saying, I feel it. So yeah, it's so interesting. Mm -hmm. I'm glad, yeah. 